Napier's inequality states that if a is less than b, then 1 over b is less than the natural log of b minus the natural log of a over b minus a, which is less than 1 over a. Let's see two proofs of this fact, the first using differential calculus techniques, and the second using integral calculus. Let's start off using differential calculus. To do this, we start with two positive real numbers a and b, with a less than b. Then, we consider the graph of the function y equals the natural log of x, which is an increasing and concave down function. We can use this graph to draw the tangent line at the point x equals a. We can also draw the tangent line at the point x equals b. And finally, we can draw the secant line between the two points x equals a and x equals b. Because the function is increasing and concave down, and a is less than b, we conclude that the slope of the tangent line at x equals a is greater than the slope of the secant line between the two points, and in turn, this slope is greater than the slope of the tangent line at x equals b. The derivative of the natural log function is y prime equals 1 over x, so the slope of the first tangent line at x equals a is 1 over a. The slope of the secant line is the natural log of b minus the natural log of a over b minus a, and the slope of the second tangent line at x equals b is 1 over b. The resulting inequality is Napier's inequality. Now let's prove the same fact using integrals. Again, assume that a and b are positive real numbers with a less than b. But this time, draw the graph of the function y equals 1 over x. This is a decreasing function. Now consider the area between the curve y equals 1 over x and the x-axis between the points x equals a and x equals b. This area is bounded below by the rectangle with height 1 over b. And the area is bounded above by the rectangle with height 1 over a. Therefore, the area of the rectangle with height 1 over a is greater than the area under the curve, which in turn is greater than the area of the rectangle of height 1 over b. The area of this rectangle is 1 over b times b minus a. The area under the curve is the integral from a to b of 1 over x. And the area of the large rectangle is 1 over a times b minus a. Applying the fundamental theorem of calculus to the integral gives us the natural log of b minus the natural log of a. Dividing each term in the inequality by the positive value b minus a results in inequality 1 over b is less than the natural log of b minus the natural log of a over b minus a, which is less than 1 over a. This again is Napier's inequality. <laughs>